Win the incredible Steigercraft 21DB Miami, powered by a Yamaha 200, in the ultimate season-long multiple species subscriber-only fishing competition, the Fisherman's 2017 Dream Boat Fishing Challenge. Go to thefisherman.com and enter today. The Fishing News is brought to you by Okuma. Hey there, Toby Lipinski for the New England edition of Fisherman Magazine. This week's web video fishing forecast for New England. Out doing a little black fishing today. Uh, black fish season just opened up this week in Connecticut. And uh, we're gonna start off right there. Here in Connecticut, the fishing reports on those black fish have already been extremely good across the sound. Uh, it's a pretty good sized fish. A lot of people have been getting their limits already. And that's uh, four fish at 16 inches. Um, for instance, Mike Crete was fishing uh, on opening day. He nailed a nice 10 plus pounder. And I got word of several others right at or around that double digit marks. So there are some good fish to be had. And speaking of those bigger black fish, if you're gonna be out this weekend, I recommend heading on over to Black Hall Outfitters prior to Saturday morning, getting in on their Togtober Tournament. It takes place this Saturday and Sunday. Fisherman Magazine is happy to be a sponsor of this great little event, and uh, you can get all the details on how to sign up and everything else you're gonna need to know at thefisherman.com. Moving on into Rhode Island, uh, while there is some pretty good saltwater fishing for striped bass, bluefish, and even false albacore right now along South County, the state is right in the middle of its fall trout stocking push. They've been stocking both brown and rainbow trout across the state, but of really interesting note is they also dropped some special golden trout this past weekend in Olney Pond, which is inside Lincoln Woods State Park. Now, early in the year, they also stocked a bunch of other places across the state, and if you head out and try for some of these goldens, if you're Lucky enough to catch one, be sure to take a photo and send it to Jessica Pina. Email address is jessica.pina, P-E-N-A, at dem.ri.gov, and you will qualify for a really cool special golden trout pin that the state hands out for anyone who catches one of these fish. And then moving on up into Massachusetts, uh, the fall pollock season in the Gulf of Maine is in full swing right now. And our friends over at the Yankee Fleet have been hammering some hefty pollock on recent trips. It's a great late season fishery for both a hard fighting and a good eating fish. If you've never targeted them before, stay tuned. We've got a great article coming out in the November issue of the New England edition of the Fisherman Magazine, written by our offshore field editor, Patrick Vo. He's a big time fall pollock guy and he gives you everything you could possibly need to know to get in on this awesome fishery. All right, well, there you have it. I'm Toby Lipinski for the New England edition of the Fisherman Magazine, wishing you tight lines if you can head out on the water this weekend. The Fishing News is brought to you by Okuma. Win the incredible Steigercraft 21DB Miami, powered by a Yamaha 200, in the ultimate season-long multiple species subscriber-only fishing competition. The Fisherman's 2017 Dream Boat Fishing Challenge. Go to thefisherman.com and enter today.